But anyway, so here's a, here's a little uh, pick from Gateway Pundit. Bidenomics, General Motors announces cuts. This is the guy. Okay, this was, remember, remember uh, Hulk Hogan, with the side-by-side -side in the pregame? We're going to play it for you again. By General Motors announces cuts. This is their union leader right here. He's, this is him last night at the convention. As he's cutting jobs, General Motors announced cuts of 1,000 software engineers, 600 in Michigan alone, the day after UAW president, because he was talking there last night, cut all the jobs today. So you have the union leader at the DNC last night uh, endorsing Kamala Waltz. He's there endorsing uh, Har Harris Waltz, right? And then the next day he knows he's going to cut jobs. He's there that night knowing he's going to cut jobs while he's endorsing the people who are causing the jobs to be cut. This is that guy. Play for me. Play for me, Aaron. The great American poet, Nelly. It's getting hot in here. Enough was enough. And I said, let Trump a media run wild, brother. Let Trump a media rule again. Let Trump a media make America great again. So he's quoting some unknown poet. And we have Hulk Hogan. I think you know who to vote for, correct? Yeah. So there you go. So there's this Bolton. Imagine that. Just imagine. You're like, Tom, get off of it. Just one more thing. <laughs> it's the same thing. But I just have to say it one more time. Imagine being there. You're, you're doing that. You're your little cuck boy on the stage, right? And you're, putting, you're saying, uh, I'm quoting, uh, poet whatever, unknown, who, uh, abstract poet moron. <laughs> and you're quoting him knowing you're about to cut a bunch of people's jobs. And endorsing the people that are causing the cuts. True. I mean, th think about what kind of person you have to be to do that.